Have you ever wondered why your blood sugar report includes a normal range or why free medical checkup camps are organized in your local area? It might seem like these are simple beneficial practices designed to help us stay healthy. But what if there's more to it? What if these seemingly innocent practices hide a darker motive? Just beneath your nose, the largest scam of our country is going on. You won't believe that all these are for the benefit of the doctors and hospitals. Let's go back to the 90s. AAM's Delhi conducted a research with the help of IM Ahmedabad. It's on how the profit in medical could be increased. The outcome? The more a patient fears their illness, the more they're willing to spend on treatment. To capitalize on this, medical reports were simplified, allowing even a moderately educated person to understand them. Normal ranges were narrowed, creating a fear factor. For instance, the actual normal blood sugar range is 60 to 120, but in reports, it's often presented as 70 to 100 milligrams per liter. This creates unnecessary panic if a patient's reading is 110. Free medical camps seem altruistic on the surface, but their primary goal is to rope in patients for costly treatments. They conduct tests, then convince attendees they're marginally ill and need immediate treatment. When a doctor assures you they can cure you easily, it might not be a serious matter at all. They could be inflating the severity of your condition to earn your trust and your money. The rabbit hole goes deeper. Much of today's medical research isn't aimed at curing diseases, but at developing ways to manage them. The goal? To keep patients reliant on medication and treatments for life. Big pharmaceutical companies sell slightly modified versions of generic drugs at exorbitant prices, and doctors are incentivized to prescribe these costly alternatives. This video is not made to scare you or to insult the medical professionals. But, like in any profession, there are those who exploit the system for personal gain. Remember, it's your health and your life on the line. Nobody has the right to gamble with it, but when some unethical is happening, we need to speak about that. We need to be aware about that. So stay vigilant and question everything about your medical care.